welcome to the ice, your Arizona State Sun Devils. The Arizona State Sun Devils hosted the Michigan State Spartans for the first ever meeting between the two programs. Both teams entered the series on the verge of being ranked. In Game 1, a battle of high-powered offenses was on display. ASU came out on top with a 5-4 victory as five different Sun Devils found the back of the net. You know, we got, we got production from everybody tonight. Um, it's nice to score five goals and, and Johnny didn't get one. So, you know, we can, we can give it to him a little bit for that. Freshman Jordan Sandu registered his first collegiate goal as a Sun Devil. Yeah, I think, you know, we just connect so well off the ice. I think that's, about, that's the biggest thing is, uh, you know, we're like a family off the ice and obviously that translates on the ice. Like Coach said, you know, it wasn't our best effort tonight, but, you know, it shows you know, how tight we are off the ice. In the second game of the series, ASU got on the board early on, and that's all the team would need to win. Latvian native Phil Buntis netted his second goal of the series on a Sun Devil power play in the second period. It added cushion to the 2-0 shutout win, and the Sun Devils completed the sweep over the Spartans. Saturday night's victory was the 200th career win, combining club and NCAA for head coach Greg Powers. I didn't even know, honestly. Um, so I think it's, it's good, you know, it, uh, 200 down, 500 to go. <laughs> the season continues to be one of many firsts for the Sun Devils. ASU has now swept a Big Ten Conference opponent for the first time ever in program history. And through just 12 games this season, the Sun Devils have already surpassed their win total from last year. We expect to win. Like we, you, you can feel it in that room when the game, before the game starts, after warm-ups, before warm-ups, when we're playing soccer before the game. Like There's a, there's a quiet intensity there and, and, and an expectation to win every night, and I think it's showing on the ice. Decord recorded his third shutout of the season. But a lot of the credit for the weekend sweep went to the ASU penalty kill, which is now ranked the best in the country at 92.7%. The guys we have on the kill, I believe, um, are there for a reason, you know, they're not uh, afraid to sell out and possibly break their ankle blocking a shot. And that's why we're so successful, because guys are putting um, the team before themselves. The Sun Devils are off to a historic start with a 9-3 record. The veteran leaders on the team, like Pashman, believe the success is only the beginning. We, we came in because we truly believed in something special. And now it's just starting to bloom. And there's going to be absolutely some incredible moments here um, in this program's history and the last two years me and Dax and our class have here. ASU will now enter a tough slate of its schedule with three straight series on the road. In Tempe, for Devils in Detail, I'm Ethan Schmidt.